When people ask me, what is the feature you want the most on future hardware platforms? My answer is always the same. Emotion. Getting the player emotionally involved is the holy grail of all game creators. We all try to trigger intense, subtle and diverse emotions. We try to make players forget that this is just a program animating pixels on the screen. We don't want them just to watch something. We want them to leave it and suspend their disbelief, experiencing that magic moment where they live in a different reality. Emotion is something complex and challenging to capture. It's conveyed by graphics, animation, sound, cinematography, dialogue, of course gameplay. In a medium like ours, technology is very important. It is what we rely on to get the player emotionally involved. If you look in the past, some films were highly emotional by being silent and black and white. But they were limited in their expression to simpler stories that had to be told under heavy technical constraints. Actors had to exaggerate their moves to convey their emotions, cameras could hardly move, and lighting as well as photography were barely concepts at the time. Cinema really became what it is today when technology evolved enough to let movie directors and actors create the subtle emotions they wanted on screen. Eventually, they developed sound, color, lighting, and high resolution formats, and suddenly, the audience could see in the eyes of the actors when they were lying or when they were about to cry. Pantomimes were not necessary anymore because the most subtle nuances of emotions could be seen on screen. With the PlayStation 4, games have now finally reached that stage. In 1999, Quantic Dream's first game, Omicron, featured characters with 350 polygons. Indigo Prophecy's main characters were around 1,500 bodies. Heavy Rain's characters were about 15,000. Chara at 20,000. This year, Jody Holmes and Beyond will be about 30,000 polygons. On PlayStation 4, this is what you can get. Quantic Dream has developed a completely new engine. What you see is running in real-time 3D on a PlayStation 4. It is our first attempt at using advanced skin shaders with translucency, realistic eye shaders, volumetric lights, 3D depth of field, and many, many other features that were up until today reserved to CG films. This is the quality that we will get in our future games. And we know we can go even further. But more important than these technical features, we, we start to reach a point where you can see very subtle emotions on the face of a character. Where you can feel his emotions just looking at his face. Where you can see his soul just looking into his eyes. When you look at this old man, you can imagine who he is, what he thinks, what happened to him, without him saying a word. But the PlayStation 4 game creators can now forget about the technology limitations and simply focus on inventing experiences never seen before. We can concentrate on what amazing stories we want to tell and what incredible worlds we want to create. We can take you to places you have never been before and make you feel emotions that you have never felt in real life without having to wonder if we will have the horsepower to do so. We are now only limited by our imagination. Thank you.